everyone, it's Lynn from Halen Vintage and we are off to an estate sale like an hour away from me. So let's get inside here and see what we can find to flip for a profit. Let's see how this works. We do got some of these. Dixie cups. Home to homes. Most of this seems to be Avon. Bob's right here. Montgomery Ward. I think that's a really good one. Remakes, I'm sure that's got to be a remake. Charlene, yes. Oh, um, the case 1977. Squirrels. Thrift Ceramics, Japan. Treasure Craft, Polynesian Village. Oh my 
Hi, buddy. How are you? You remind me of my grandson. Yeah, you about the same age. Excuse me. Cute little tea. Um, ooh, I think I want to say that I'll spend popcorn like I said for some money. I'm not really sure. It's Roseville. I got soda two for eight. No, no. Oh, here's a Windex touch up cleaner. But that might do good. I'm thinking I'm going to grab that. There's some different Pyrex over here. Excuse me, I wanted to get back in this corner. If that's okay? Sure. Thank you. Oh, I got the 25 on that. Mm. Yeah, oh, look at that. It's a flower bin up in there. How cool is that? That's cool. There's a hopper in the cabinet. All right, everyone, we're going to go through the stuff that I picked up at the estate sale. So let's get into it. All right. So these are the items that I picked up um, from the estate sale. First off, this little guy is going to go to Mary. How cute is he? He is actually in Inesco Imports. Um, so glows good. She collects these little ceramic banks. So... Of course, we're going to send that to her. I did pick up these containers that say, um, I thought, that, you know, I must have been hungry or something because I thought they said cookies. I thought, oh, that would be so cute with the, the um, window on there, put some chocolate chip cookies on there. But these are actually 1958 cooking index. Well, cook index, they used to be filled with cards. If they would have had the cards in them, they probably would have been worth like, I don't know, 20, 20 to $30 maybe. But um, I still think they're super great. I still think that um, they're in great condition and we could clean them up, put ribbons on them. And I say give them away with cookies in them. Why not? I did kind of a lot of smalls because... The items that I really wanted were kind of high priced. So here is a, I thought these were kind of cool. This whole package for $2. Um, just these little, uh, little nativities. I don't know if they go on lights. They do have little holes in there if they're just ornaments. But there is a set of six of them. I grabbed those. I did grab these. All right, so I picked up these little deer. I think this is a package of six. I believe they say Hong Kong on them. Um, we got, what else we got in here? I had also gone to... A couple of stops, like, on my way back and stuff. I did pick up this Noma Angel. I live on a very busy street. Sorry about that. They had 25 on her, but I still think she sells for, like, $80. Her package, um, even though this is split, but this is just still... Look at that, $1.89 previously. She is still just kind of cool. I'm hoping she works. So 
I did grab her. Um, I did grab the West Bend Butter Medic Four Quart. Um, it was in good shape. There was this lead pencil in here, too, that they gave me. Michigan Verified Title Company. And it's got a um, Michigan Verified Tile Company. And it's got a verified drain tile. There's, like, water inside there and stuff. So, um, I think everybody is driving by here today. So, we got those. I'm just going to leave that in there. You know, this Windex touch-up stuff, this stuff here, I want to say this sells for like almost $18 is antibacterial. I don't think they make it anymore, so that's why I grabbed that for $1. Um, I did grab this set of silverware. Uh, six knives, two serving spoons, five soup spoons, spoons, ten, three forks, and eight salad forks. But it is in an atomic pattern. So usually um, that pattern you should sell pretty good. Let's see if we can't get that. So I had to look that up. It is Superior Stainless USA. So we have that. Um, and I did grab these camping lights. So I did grab three of them. So the two are done. And this one is a kit to make it yourself. It still has all of the plastic everything in here look at that walmart a dollar 74 lawn wear made in usa huh wonder how old that actually is that's kind of cool but it has like all of the lights to make it and stuff so i did get two that were completed they had a lot of them but i just grabbed the small ones um let's see over here I do have another cookie container, right? Cookies. And then, you know, this Kleenex Splash and Go. Even the diaper ones, they sell. This one sells probably $20 free shipping. People want these hard containers. They can't get them anymore. And a Miller Studio fish. One little fish. So, I don't know what I'm going to do with him. If I'm just going to put him in my bathroom, he's got... I have fish in my bathroom. So on the um, way back, I stopped at two places. So I'm just going to include that in here too. I found at a small little thrift store. <gasps> Waterford. $1.99 for the set. Still have their Waterford stickers right there. So those are really nice. So $1.99 on those. And um, last thing. I picked up this Shawnee Pottery because... Christmas is upon us, and I thought he was super cute. She let me have it for four, but I loved the little elf on there. So with that being said, this is Lynn from Halen Vintage. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Those are my treasures from today. Um, a lot of them will be coming to a live sale near you, so... Watch for those on Wednesday evenings at 5 p.m. Eastern. With that being said, stay retro, my friends.
Bye.